Hey everybody and welcome to Big City Little Kitchen. That's right, this is the cooking show for anybody who lives in a big city but is confined to a small kitchen and not a lot of counter space. I don't want you to fret. You can still make a delicious, classy meal with five ingredients in under. So it's not about how many ingredients, it's about what? The quality of the ingredients. That's right. So we're gonna do this quick. We're gonna get you in and out of the kitchen so your other roommate can come in and they can cook and everybody's happy. So today, we are gonna be making a delicious, fresh Parmesan fresh herb quiche. Now, I've got that delicious pie crust already pre-made. It's in the fridge ready for us. We're gonna whip up some farm fresh eggs. So follow me to the refrigerator and let's get those suckers. So I got these eggs at the farmer's market yesterday. They were laid yesterday as fresh as can be. Now, if you're worried about your eggs, you're not sure if they're fresh enough, take it, put it in a bowl of water. If it floats to the top, it's too late. Sorry guys, but these are fresh. And you also wanna look at the yolks. If the yolks have that really rich orange color, that means these eggs are fresh. These chickens were healthy. They were doing yoga. They're spiritually sound. That's what you wanna look out for. So we're actually gonna make enough to last you through the week. So we're gonna blend all 12 eggs and you'll have leftovers because when you get home from that busy job, you can just pop this sucker in the microwave. So we're gonna take 12 eggs and we're gonna What the fuck? Fuck! God damn it, Greg! You left me one egg? You sleeping, you piece of shit? Dude, what the fuck, man? Did you eat my eggs? I did, dude. I got- For the show! I gotta use all 12, dude! You gotta be fucking kidding. Why did you eat them? These are mine. They're on my shelf that's labeled my name. I'm sorry, dude. I, I thought they were mine. Fuck you, dude. God damn, just cut this. All right, guys. So today we are gonna be making a delicious egg on toast. Sometimes uh, you forget to get eggs. You space out because you're so busy but that's okay, uh, these eggs are delicious. We're gonna fry it up, fresh herbs, right on some toast uh, and some Parmesan cheese, of course. So you're gonna wanna get this sucker on medium high and let that come up to eat, up to heat. Get your olive. Get your olive oil and you, you're gonna want, you don't wanna use too, fuck, Karen, shut off the techno. Jack it up. Okay, so today we are gonna be doing an egg on toast. That's all you need, we're busy, just, it's good to get some food in your stomach so you feel, fuck! Stupid fucking city, I wanna, ah, fuck. Goddamn fucking acting career. Oh yeah, you could be, do theater, you could do anything. God fucking damn it, doing a goddamn cooking show. All right, let's run it again. Okay, so we are gonna be doing an egg. What the fuck? Whose dog is this? We are gonna be doing an egg on toast. No, exactly. Easy. That's what I'm saying. She she is not present with me at dinner, and that triggers me. Pat. I know. What am I supposed to do when? Pat, are you fucking kidding me, dude? We're shooting the cooking show. I texted you twelve to two. We do it every Monday. It's not like a different Monday where we're not doing the cooking show. No, bro, I, I, I got virtual therapy. I, to, I told you. Johnny, Johnny, you still there? Oh my fucking God, dude. No, and that's what I'm saying is, that's where the Pisces and the Scorpio don't line up. Right, and I told her I would be okay with that if she starts eating. Right, I, 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 I split that movie with you now. Hey bro, can I get an egg for this? Can I borrow an egg for this? 
Oh, you want an egg for the shake? Yeah. I got one left, so. Oh. Fuck! You got 30 days, man. Sick of this shit. All right, easy. We're doing an egg on toast. Grab your egg. We're gonna heat. Oh my god. All right, so today we're just gonna be doing a simple fried egg on toast with some fresh Parmesan cheese that my grandmother sent me from Italy. So let's grab that sucker. Now, again, it's all about quality. This is 24 months age. This is classic Italian. You gotta be fucking kidding me, dude. Greg, tell me you didn't eat all the cheese. How did you eat an entire block of cheese? Dude, this is like a year's worth of cheese. I thought that was What the f dude? You f My grandmother fucking died three weeks ago, man. She sent this to me and she said, make me something. You f You have 30 days, dude. You have 30 days. Pack it up. Fucking asshole. Fuck, dude. God damn it. <laughs> That's the fucking thing she said. Me. She's like, make something for me. I hate this fucking city, dude. I hate it. I'm gonna be a fucking theater actor. It's really fucking hard to make money doing theater. It's really hard. Rehearsals like all day, so I'm working at H&M, and then I gotta go to fucking rehearsal at night. It's fucking, they don't tell you that in college. They don't fucking tell you that. Like, oh, you can be... God, and they don't have any fucking white guys anymore. Like, sorry, we don't want any fucking white guys. It's because all these are... God damn it. I don't fucking like cooking, dude. Oh, 